B. Alonzo is a British Filipino actress, model, and a singer. Born and brought up in Rizal, Philippines, she struggled initially, but once she had her breakthrough, she never looked back and paved her way to become an international sensation. In the initial phases of her acting career, she received appreciation for her role in films like Now That I Have You and Dream Boy and she started her TV career simultaneously with series such as K. Tegel Kong Hinante, It Might Be You and ASAP. She kept doing major roles in her projects and slowly made her mark, and eventually got the leading part in the sitcom I Love Betty Lafia, which happened to be the remake of an American-based sitcom. B played the leading role of Betty and received appreciation for her comic timing and acting chops. Her career further extended with several films and TV series, which included the super-hit series Sinabuka's Pa Ankaha, and she also has received many awards and nominations for her performances over the years. B came up with her music album The Real Me in 2008 and left a solid mark on the music industry as well. Childhood and Early Life B. Alonzo was born on October 17, 1987 in Rizal, Philippines to a British father and a Filipino mother. She was the oldest child in the family, and facing her parents' separation at a tender age of four was a very unpleasant experience for her. It left her scarred for a long time that followed, but also made her quite strong-headed. She was brought up by three women in her life, her mother, her grandmother and her aunt and somehow, this constant moving around also caused troubles for her psychologically. As a result of this hectic lifestyle, she grew depressed and said in interviews that she was lonely, cut off from rest of the world during her early teenage years. Somehow, she managed to finish her primary school education by the time she started dreaming about a career in films. She started honing her acting skills herself and at the age of 13, she was located by a talent manager Archie Alagan. He saw the burning passion in the young girl to do something big with her life and decided to further hone her skills. She was immediately enrolled at the ABS-CBN Star Circle Batch in 2000. Her grandmother asked her to try out for the beauty contests as it would have been a perfect stage for B to start her entertainment career. B was determined to not let her career take any other route than acting and confident of her skills as an actor, she kept auditioning for different parts in TV and films. After auditioning around for quite a few months, she was finally selected to feature in the series K2 Boo, in a minor role. And from that to starring in a meaty role in the series K Tegel Kong Hanante, she gave a few more additions. Career K, K Tegel Kong Hanante went on air in 2012 and B played the role of Katrina, who falls in love with the first love of her older sister. The soap opera was a major hit among the audiences and the critics alike and eventually became first-ever Filipino soap opera to get nominated at the International Emmy Awards. This early success benefited B massively and she also received a nomination her performance at the PMPC Star Awards. Another nomination for a PMPC Star Award came to her in 2004 for the series It Might Be You and in the same year, she was included in the FHM Philippines 100 Sexiest Women list, at the 36th spot. After making her film debut in the year 2003 with the film My First Romance, she appeared in the film Now That I Have You, a romance drama film which received average ratings from the critics, but went on to become a financial success. In 2006, she received a number of acting awards for her leading role in the series Maging Sino Ka Man which included Outstanding Performance as an Actress Award at the Annual Visionary Awards and Best Drama Actress Honor at the PMPC Drama Awards. Music had always been her another passion and after getting established as an actor, she focused on her music projects, which resulted in the release of her debut album The Real Me in 2008. Her already huge and growing fan following made sure the success of the album, and although the music critics weren't particularly praised with the quality of her music, the album was a success. Later in 2008, she joined the cast of sitcom I Love Betty Lafia, where B essayed the titular role of Betty. The series was the Filipino version of a popular sitcom where B played the role of highly intelligent girl who gets trolled by her office mates due to her odd appearance. B won the Best Actress Award at the MTRCB Awards that year.
2009's film And I Love You So was another milestone in her already flourishing acting career. The film was a mega success in BEA's portrayal of a girl who suffers heartbreak after the death of her loving husband, met with general appreciation. B was consecutively establishing her as the female jack of all trades, with her role choices ranging from dramas to comedies naturally. In between the awards she kept receiving for a number of her performances, she was also getting constantly adorned with the honors for her appearance. She won the Best Dressed Celebrity and the Most Powerful Celebrity Awards in 2009 at the Yes! Magazine Awards. She received another bout of massive success with the 2013 romantic melodrama film The Mistress, which revolved around a love triangle between two men and a woman. The film was received very well by the critics and the audiences, and eventually became one of the top-grossing films of the years of the year. And the film slowly paved its way to become the 16th highest-grossing Filipino film of all times. After receiving many awards for her performance in The Mistress, B went on impressing everyone with her portrayal of a heartbroken lawyer in the 2016 film The Love Affair. Although the film was an average critical success, there was no questioning about the financial success of the film, as it went on to become a big hit. B won Luna Award for Best Actress for her heartbreaking portrayal of a broken woman. In 2019, Alonzo appeared in the horror film Eerie and the dramatic film Unbreakable. She also started pursuing writing for film in 2019 by enrolling in the writing workshop of Philippine screenwriter, journalist, novelist, and playwright Ricky Lee. This year, she was also included in the list of Variety.com and the International Film Festival and Awards Macau as among Asia's biggest star stars poised for international stardom. On July 1, 2021, GMA News announced that she transferred to GMA Network as she signed with exclusive contract after almost 19 years under ABS-CBN. The mega-success of her film A Second Chance also opened ways for her to become quite a favorite at many 2016 award functions. Apart from acting, B has done quite a lot of hosting for TV variety shows and due to her regular appearance outside of her fiction projects, she has remained a loved celebrity among her fans during all the years that she has been active. Personal Life Although B. Alonzo has maintained that she is single at present, she has been linked with many of her co-stars in the past. The list includes John Lloyd Cruz and Gerald Anderson. It has been claimed that she was in a relationship with Gerald for about a year. Her long-term relationship with a fellow actor Zanjo Zan Maruto has also been in news for quite some time. They were together from 2010 until 2016. On July 18, 2023, Alonzo announced through an Instagram post her engagement to actor Dominic Roque. In a joint Instagram post on February 11, 2024, Alonzo and Dominic Roque confirmed the end of their relationship. After much thought, consideration, and care, we have mutually decided to amicably end our engagement, they wrote.